Hi friends, the fact is that age is mostly responsible for our wrinkles and saggy skin. We all age. I'm aging because I don't want to die young. Wrinkles may be bad news, but the good news is that we don't have to accept them or smash our mirror, but smash the myth that we can't do much to reduce the signs of aging. Today, I'll share with you a recipe for my homemade anti-aging facial mask, which I've been using for the last 20 years. I have not done any other facials other than this face mask. It also acts as a scrub, so it's two in one. It's cheap, it's packed with those vitamins that are helpful keeping the skin toned, youthful and glowing. I'll show you how to make it. Um, I make it in a large quantity, say for two months. And this is the jar which is really full for two months. And it's enough for um, eight to 10 applications. And uh, I use it weekly. If you want, you can also use it twice a week. So let's make the amount today for four to five applications here. Now the first ingredient we need is dried orange peel. Dry peel um, of two to three uh, tangerines are over here. It's a thin peel because uh, tangerines, they have thin skin, so it dries up much quicker. So I prefer this to orange peel. So otherwise, if you don't have tangerine peel, then you can uh, use a, a peel of one large orange. I know you don't have this ready and it takes a few weeks before uh, the peel will be crisp dry. But once you dry it in bulk, um, it can last for many applications. I usually buy a whole pack of oranges, ask the family to put the peel in a separate container to dry up. And that really lasts for many, many weeks. So, so one thing is that you need to dry this in the shade. Here, so the peel needs to be dried in the shade, yeah? Now, citrus peel is packed with vitamin C, antioxidant which helps the skin fight off the damage caused by free radicals and it helps the skin to look plump and youthful. And now the oatmeal. We need now the second ingredient is oatmeal. So we need two tablespoon, heapful tablespoon of porridge oats. You can use roll, rolled oats as well. Uh, this oatmeal is so soothing. A good skin cleanser, especially for dry, sensitive and irritated skin. And it's also an excellent scrub for exfoliation. And the third ingredient is almonds. Yeah, we need, again, two tablespoons of almonds. They are rich in vitamin E. And this vitamin E, this is known to boost skin radiance and it makes you look younger. Also, again, it acts as an excellent scrub. So for the time being, um, you can make a mixture with fresh peel. Take one teaspoon of ground almond and one teaspoon of oatmeal in freshly ground peel of one small tangerine. Over here we have this tangerine, so you can just peel, have to use the peel and make a fresh mixture to use and then you can use it and if there's leftover then you can put that in the fridge to use it again maybe within two days or three two three days so now i'm going to take all these three ingredients to waste in my food processor so in it goes in goes almonds and our oatmeal Yeah, so now this mixture is ready. Now I'll take two heapful, teaspoon tea, tea heapful of this grainy mixture. This is quite grainy, you can see. Yeah, it's quite uh, grainy. And uh, now, just to make it more potent and more effective, I usually put vitamin E drops, or you can just squeeze one vitamin a D a vitamin E capsule so just 
2 3 drops of vitamin E so that's vitamin E here and uh, warm water just to get the right consistency you have to put as much as you think that is uh, easily you can apply it on your face so i think is the right consistency it won't drip down here and there if it's too thin then it can just drip down yeah it's done now just put my <coughs> my hair band yes yeah so i'm ready to uh, now apply this on my face i think a little bit more water and <clears throat> there you go so just you can use that um, very close to maybe a sink your bathroom sink because it's quite messy otherwise so just you have to leave your eyes uh, while you're doing this and don't forget your neck now you can leave this um, mixture on your face this mask on your face for maybe 20 minutes 25 minutes uh, i usually just let it dry a bit and then i just uh, lean over my bathroom sink and then scrub it just give a scrubbing motion so all the dead cells they are removed so i'm going i'm not going to do this over here but yes this is what you can do on the sink so after scrubbing you just rinse your face thoroughly with the lukewarm water and yeah i feel this mask works wonders it's looking so i mean i feel very fresh do after doing that so there's no pricey lotion or potion a simple mask and a scrub that goes a long way in keeping your skin radiant brighter and young looking please try it and i'll wait for your feedback please share this video and press the like share and subscribe button for more tips on health and beauty thank you